I have the opportunity today to be with Nadine Taylor and with Mike Muridian at the SLS, the largest trade show for automation and so for Hamilton. Good morning, I'm Nadine Taylor. I'm head of marketing lab automation. Good morning, my name is Michael Meridian. I am the Vice President of Scientific Strategy and Market Development. I'm Gabby Bosamoran, I'm the Senior Team Leader Marketing. For Hamilton, SLAS is the key driver for us to showcase our technologies, showcase innovation at the cross-section of science and technology. Overall, SLAS is the key opportunity for us to engage with our colleagues, our peers, and also you know, thought leaders in the industry. Our ability to engage with them at this level is, is just amazing for Hamilton. How important is SLAS for the teams in Europe? As Mike said, SLS um, is very large new product at a global scale, first time to the customers. In this year's trade show, we launched some exciting new products and give a glimpse to our customers on upcoming technologies. We have product managers over to support the Booth team uh, with these global launches. What is your general impression about the show? Have you noticed anything different from the previous SLS? For this year, it's crazy. It's another banner year for SLAS. We've had over 7,000 attendees. We've showcased 17 presentations, poster presentations, including Hamilton Technology. We have eight partner booths that we have um, have engaged in a scavenger hunt with, which is really exciting. But overall, we've showcased our technologies in a way, and our innovations in a way, that, as I said before, that crosses into that science and technology innovation, um, where we show our application-focused solutions, we show our, our new technologies in the innovation hub with fluid motion, and then expand that out. And the reception has been just so great. So Nadine, which one are the products highlights that we're showcasing this year and which one has attracted more attention to our booth? So this year we have the first global product launch for lab solutions with the MicroLab Purify being a benchtop solution for PCR and NGSP cleanup. But besides this uh, fantastic new product, we are also showing exciting products as the Vantage Plus, the NGS Starlet, um, but we also brought cell biology solutions such as the Bioreactor on Star V, the Cell Care Star. We are showcasing storage solutions and we also give the customer the chance to have a glimpse on our new channel X1 on fluid motion. Mike, Hamilton is also showing and sponsoring some talks here at SLS. Can you tell us more about the content and how has it been perceived? The events yesterday uh, were excellent and well received by the attendees. It was by the Allen Institute covering the automated uh, workflow of 3D cell culture, which is, as Nadine said earlier, is like one of our main focus areas. So it was really opportunistic for us to um, engage with those attendees and then bring them back to the booth to engage in those conversations even more. Today we have a talk uh, with Deep Care and Integrant covering the automatic liquid class development and chemical synthesis screening. Um, I'm really excited to see that talk and see how we get engagement um, in bioprocessing and other chemical synthesis type of workflows. Tomorrow, Catherine and our product tester, Labor Berlin, is going to showcase the um, MicroLab Purify and its mobility to be the small benchtop device focused on magnetic bead cleanup. Last question for both of you. 
Have you seen any trends specific to this SLS? Yes, uh, we still see a lot of cell biology um, throughout the show, followed by very, very interesting technologies on liquid dispensing picked up by startups and a big focus on software. Yes, exactly. So um, as Nadine said, we, we see these fully integrated solutions, application focused solutions. We're also seeing the software integration, as Nadine said, with these integrators and the software integration um, is now starting to leverage AI and machine learning as part of either the workflow or as part of the analytics on the back end. So it's, it's really exciting time to see all of these new advances in our industry. So we're excited to be here.